Hey friends, it's time for another episode of Roll for Zine, inspired of course by adventures in Ardia's Roll for Sandwich. First we're going to roll a d4, even or odd, are we making or reading? It's a three, so we're going to be making a zine today. I am thrilled. I was hoping we would get make a zine sooner rather than later. Next up, of course, is our D8 topic roll. Let's narrow down what our zine's going to be about. All right, that's a two, which means it's a fanzine. This is perfect. I've had an idea for a very specific fanzine I wanted to make for a while. So if the rest of these rolls play out in my favor, we're going to make a really cool fanzine today. All right, now we need to roll another D4, another Dillinger 4 if you're a music fan, and find out what size. It's a 1. That's a mini. That's great. I am getting over a cold, so I don't want to be using too much brain power today, so a mini zine is all right with me. All right, now let's choose what music will use as the soundtrack for the end of this video. Here's a D12. And... We're choosing something from the first shelf of my record collection, which I think I already have an idea of what album I want to choose. If I could just get my highlighter to work. There we go. I'm gonna choose Living in Darkness by Agent Orange. They're a surf punk band that was formed in the 70s in California, and they will fit the vibe I'm going for perfectly. All right. What are we using to make our zine? We got a D4. Thank goodness. We can use every tool at our disposal. We can use the computer. We can use collage materials. We can use Sharpies. I'm here for it. Now we've got to choose our paper. It'll be numbered 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Let's roll a D8. All right, we rolled a three, so that's the red paper. This is perfect. This all fits the theme I'm going for perfectly. But before I tell you what it is, we need some wild magic. And that's an eight. This is amazing. So my friend Jay Dream runs the zine distro Neither Nor. So at the end of this video, I'll ask them if they would sell the finished product in their shop. And if they say yes, you can pick up a copy of it. All right, so we're making a fanzine. It's going to be a mini zine, and it's going to be on red paper, and we can use all the tools at our disposal to create it. Okay, let's get started, and first, cue the music. So I want to make a fanzine about Vincent Price. He's one of my favorite actors. I'm going to pull some images off the internet, um, but this won't just be about Vincent Price specifically. It'll be about Vincent Price's love of roller coasters. So I've got my text printed, my images printed, now I'm working on the collage. And after a few good hours of collaging, this is what I came up with. Let's get it printed and assembled. So each mini zine has to be folded, and then I make a cut in the middle, and I assemble and fold the mini zine, just like that. And what I ended up with is riding roller coasters with Vincent Price. So that's the finished zine. I love how it turned out. And as for that wild magic, I asked J Dream if they would distro it, and they are in. So coming soon to neither nor zine distro is riding roller coasters with Vincent Price. And that's it. I'll see y'all next week for another episode.